Welcome. In a previous video, I talked about some tips for uh, recording the screen on a Mac, and one of those tips is to switch resolution to like 720p, and that makes everything bigger on the screen. I film a lot of my screen captures on this 2015 MacBook Pro, and I have it connected up to an external monitor, so I can go into my displays and change the resolution of the screen. But if I don't have an external display connected up, I can't change the resolution to 720p. If I click on displays here and we click on scaled, you see we get larger text, default, you can't read this probably, but <laughs> it's larger text, default, and then you have more space. So, you know, it doesn't have, um, you know, definitive resolution changing on it. So there is some software called Switch Res X you can install on your computer, which uh, gives you resolutions to switch to. But I have this hardware device that I ordered that will give me the same um, capabilities. And this is kind of dumb that you can't change the resolution on here. I, you know, but I really can't change that. So I have this here and it's a monitor emulator. And I'll put a link in the description of this. And if you use that link, it helps me out a little bit and doesn't cost you anything extra. I'll also put a link to a similar product for DisplayPort. And I'll put, if I can find them, I'll put some adapters on there too if you have mini um, HDMI or micro HDMI. But um, this is essentially like plugging a monitor in. So if I go over here to my HDMI port on the side and plug this in, the computer will think that I plugged an extra monitor in. So what that does is that allows me to go in here to arrangement and I can say mirror displays. And now it's mirroring my internal display with the little adapter over here. And then I can go and change these resolutions here. So I can click uh, best for my TV or I can click scaled. And it has you know 480p, 720p, 1080i, 1080p, I mean, it has tons of resolutions up here. Um, it even goes up to um, 4K. Like if I hit that, you'll see now my screen resolution is just tiny on here um, because it's trying to emulate a 4K TV. But I can also go here to 720p and I can um, you know, view this at 720p on my retina display, and then I can do a screen capture and a little screen capture at 720p. So I have an older MacBook that's non-retina, and it wouldn't need this kind of hack to make this work. But on this retina Mac, um, this is one way to be able to get to 720p, 1080p. It kind of sucks having this stick out. If you don't want anything to stick out, you could look at the Switch Res X software. But this is, uh, this is actually cheaper than the software, and I think it'll work. Uh, I don't do this very often, but every once in a while I want to take my laptop somewhere uh, away from my desk and do a screen recording and this will allow me to do that and to switch to 720p. So if you have any questions about this please leave it in the comments. If you like this video please click like. If you haven't subscribed to my channel I'd appreciate it if you could do that. And thanks for watching. Until next time, goodbye!